Hello, hello, YouTube viewers. Before this video begins, I just want to let you know I recommend that you do what the Bible says in this video about temptation. I recommend that you do it whenever you're watching TV or having any other kind of fun that you love. Every time it does not require a lot of concentration. Please keep that in mind as you watch this video. Inquire among themselves which of them it was that should do this thing. And there was also a strife among them, which of them should be accounted. And they began, truly the Son of Man goeth, as it was determined. But woe unto that man by whom he is betrayed. And they began to inquire among themselves which of them it was that should do this thing. And there was also a strife among them, which of them should be accounted the greatest. And he said unto them, The kings of the Gentiles exercise lordship over them, and they that exercise authority upon them are called benefactors. But ye shall not be so. But he that is greatest among you, let him be as the younger, and he that is chief as he that doth serve. For whether is greater, he that sitteth at meat, or he that serveth, is not he that sitteth at meat. But I am among you as he that serveth. Ye are they which have continued with me in my temptations. And I appoint unto you a kingdom, as my Father hath appointed unto me, that ye may eat and drink at my table in my kingdom, and sit on thrones judging the twelve tribes of Israel. And the Lord said, Simon. Simon, behold. Heavenly well, Father, I confess my sins. I forgive those that have sinned against me or ticked me off. Lord, Lord, I ask you to help myself and every Christian Help us to be the servants of those who you want us to serve because of Luke 22. Lord, Lord, your word says the person who is greatest among us, let them be the servant of all. So, Lord, I ask you to help myself and every Christian, help us to serve people in the way and at the times that you would see fit. Lord, I ask you to help us to not complain. Lord, I ask you to help us to love serving others because John chapter 14 is where Jesus says, if you love me, keep my commandments. And in, and in Mark 9, all things are possible to those who believe. And in Matthew 7 and in John 14, ask and you shall receive. And in Philippians 4, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Lord, I just ask this for all my, for, I meant to say, Lord, I ask this for my self and every Christian. That's what I meant to say. I ask this for myself and every Christian in Jesus' merciful name. YouTube viewers, if this video helps you obey that passage that we just heard in Luke 22, please let me know in the comments. But if you're not able to leave a comment, that is by pure accident. Now, you may or may not hear one other passage from Luke 22. But I had a reminder made on, on my iPad here to make a video showing Luke 22 and pray to do what it says. So that's the main reason I'm I'm making this video. So if you hear of another passage in this video, that's because that's because I want to make sure 
that I pray about everything that the Lord said to do in Luke 22. But please like, share, and subscribe, even if there is another Bible passage and another prayer in, in this video. Thank you. Lord, behold, here are two swords. And he said unto them, It is enough. And he came out, and went, as he was wont, to the Mount of Olives. And his disciples also followed him. And when he was at the place, he said unto them, Pray that ye enter not into temptation. And he was withdrawn from them about a stone's cast. And when he was at the place, he said unto them, Pray that ye enter not into temptation. And he was withdrawn from them about a stone. And he came out, and went, as he was wont, to the Mount of Olives. And his disciples also followed him. And when he was at the place, he said unto them, Pray that ye enter not into temptation. Folks, folks, before I continue, I just want you to keep in mind, if I say that, that Luke 6 says to pray to not yield to temptation, I mean Matthew 6 and I mean Luke 22. I just wanted to clarify that before I begin this part of the video. Heavenly Father, I confess my sins. I forgive those that have sinned against me and ticked me off. Lord, because Matthew 6 and Luke 22 both say that we should pray that we won't yield to temptation. And because 1 Thessalonians 5 says to pray without ceasing, which means to never stop praying. Lord, Lord. I pray that when we are watching TV and during every form of entertainment, I pray that we will obey Luke 22 and Matthew 6. I pray that we will continually pray at those times and every time we are having fun and doing what we love. I pray that at those times when we are having fun and doing what we love, in addition to when we're watching TV, I pray that we will continually say, Lord, please don't. I pray that at those times, that we will continually say, Lord, please don't let me yield to temptation. Lord, I Lord, I just ask you to help us to I just ask you to help us to to pray that the right amount of times every day. Lord, I just ask this for myself and every Christian in Jesus' name. Folks, folks. John 14 is where Jesus says, If you love me, keep my commandments. Mark 9 says, All things are possible to those who believe. Philippians 4 says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. If this video is making you want to get closer to to God, please like, share, and subscribe. And if the part where I prayed about temptation made you want to obey God more, please let me know in the comments. But if you're not able to leave a comment, that is by pure accident. If you are not able to leave a comment, that is by pure accident. Thank you.